Hi, my name is Falk. Since August, I've been studying at university. I'm studying product management and generally loving life. I have great friends, I love the work I'm doing, and I have a pretty fun lifestyle at the minute. But there's something people don't really warn you about before going to university. Your life gets very busy very quick. I spend most of my time either studying, having a class, working because I have a job, or actually working again because I'm also working in a startup, cooking for myself, spending time with friends, working out, trying to do self-care, or just trying to get enough sleep. Yeah, so it's a tired. lot. And if I didn't have any discipline, then I wouldn't be able to balance any of this. And to be honest, from September until January, I was doing a pretty bad job at this whole balancing thing. There were lots of things I wanted to do, but that I just didn't. I stopped working out as much. I stopped doing mindfulness entirely. And I stopped posting on YouTube for a while. I started giving in to lots of short-term gratification, scrolling through my phone more instead of reading, getting distracted while working, and having a terrible sleep schedule. 2 a.m. and I just got back. The less productive and focused I was being, the worse I felt about myself. I didn't like the weak person I was becoming. I didn't feel in control of my life and where I was going anymore. But why was my life falling out of balance when deep down I did want to be productive and I did want to strive towards my goals? Well, the simplest answer I can give you is that I lost my discipline. Uh, but what does that really mean? Uh, let me break it down for you. In its simplest form, self-discipline means to delay gratification, or in even simpler terms, to resist eating this box of chocolates because you want abs in a few months' time. So it's our ability to resist a temptation now to get a goal later on. And doing this all the time is hard because sometimes you're tired and you just want that box of chocolates. But lots of research shows that disciplined people are indeed happier and that discipline and willpower work similarly to our muscles. When you exercise them in the short term, it can be painful, but the more regularly you use them, the easier and stronger they get in the long term. So since the new year, I've been trying to train this muscle that is discipline. Right now, I feel pretty happy with my level of discipline. And so I thought I'd share some things that have helped me to achieve this. We've all had this moment, right, where we think about doing something productive, but after five seconds, we decide, nah, I'd rather not. Research has actually shown that when those five seconds are up, that motivation is lost, it's gone. So something I've started doing is counting down from five and just doing that thing. This has replaced my overthinking mind with action. And this has actually made such a huge difference in just getting stuff done. Second thing that I've been doing that actually makes a huge difference is meditating. Hear me out. When you're working, the hardest part is often focusing. Not looking at your phone, not thinking about something else, not getting distracted by friends. And nowadays, our attention is non-existent. We have apps fighting for it, and most of us watch short, engaging TikToks that have killed our attention span. So one way to get this attention back is by doing this. It's quite simple. As soon as I wake up, I stick on a random 10 minute meditation from so YouTube. Glad you're joining. All you have to do is close your eyes and focus on your breath. That's it. And it actually feels very good not scrolling through social media as your first action of the day. Third thing I've started doing is removing distractions. Let's be honest, if your phone is next to you when you're working, you're bound to look at it at some point. Once you hear a notification from your phone, your monkey brain has to see what it is. So best thing I recommend, out of sight, out of mind. Next up, I recommend setting clear goals. I'll give you a good example. I want 100k YouTube subscribers by the end of this year. But the goal I've also set to actually achieve this is posting every week before Sunday because that's the only way I'm actually going to achieve it. Thinking about your goals is great for motivating yourself, but it isn't enough without a plan. Final step, and this might be one of the most important steps, is creating habits. We've all heard about 
habits, but essentially your life is the sum of all of your habits. This is why I created the habit of meditating every time as soon as I wake up for 10 minutes. I go to the gym straight after cooking dinner and I read just before going to sleep for 30 minutes every time. Having the habit of doing something at a specific time every day removes the energy required to motivate yourself to do it. So yeah, I hope this video helped motivate you, but remember, discipline always beats motivation.